Hi, I read an article in today's Wall Street Journal entitled, Amazon Sues New Target Executive. The first paragraph of the article says that Amazon Cumming filed suit against a longtime logistics and supply chain executive, recently hired by rival Target Corp, over what it said was a violation of a non-compete agreement. Non-competes are one of the most hotly uh, contested provisions in any employment contract. So the concern here is that Amazon is worried that the 16-year veteran of their company is going to use trade secrets uh, for the benefit of uh, Target and hurt Amazon by using those uh, critical confidential information and trade secret uh, particulars. So what happens in a case like this? Well, the, 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 the courts are going to determine whether or not the non-compete is enforceable. It's going to be based on the language of the non-compete. It's going to be based on the specific language, the scope, the duration, the geographic range, all of those particulars, what the, um, what the individual employee upon leaving can and cannot do. And the court will make that determination. It will also be, uh, the determination will also be not only with the language, but it will be based on what this particular person has done. Is he actually going into Target to use those trade secrets? Have they set up firewalls? Have they arranged for him to work and not violate the non-compete? So we'll have to keep an eye on this case to see uh, what's going to happen and what the court will decide. But the lesson of this case is that it's very important to pay attention to the specific language of non-competes when you're negotiating your employment contract because that uh, provision will have a direct impact on you in the event that you are no longer in the employ of that company. Uh, so we'll watch this and uh, I will keep you posted. Thank you.